see how she is at the shore. Welcome to Sunnyburg Outdoors. Conditions are hanging on. We're back out on the little lake with the ATV. We're going to try to catch some pike or perch or wherever it'll bite. Monsoon rains are coming. Conditions are going downhill. I know I sound like a broken record. This might be it. Let's do it. Looks like a perch. Oh, here it is, not big, a perch. On the scissor kick, frostbite, I believe that's a quarter or three eighths ounce. A little perch, too small, let you go. I think we got a fish taking her here now. He's taking it on the uh, Akumo bait feeder. We're going to set him. He wants to go. He's fighting. Gotta get him up the hole right now. That's the thing. Oh, he's a fighter. Run out of room here. Oh no, he's on the ice. There he goes. Come on up. Come on up. Get your head up. Get your head up. Get your head up. There you go. That's not a bad one. I said that I would keep Chris one for Good Friday. So I think we'll do we'll keep this one. Probably 24, pretty close, 25. We'll keep that one. Something small down there again, probably a perch. There he is, not very big. Another little perch. <clears throat> On the scissor kick. That's insanity pepper color. Too bad he went about four inches longer, he'd be good eating. Let him go. Well, the finicky fooler hasn't really been fooling him too much today. When I first come out, I cut a bunch of holes all around. Some shallow, some deeper, some more in weeds, some not. And I've been moving every half an hour or so, moving locations, checking it out. But not much yet. We got a sucker on here, four and a half inch or so, and uh, we're gonna put her down, try another spot, see what happens. We're in a weed bed here, so it's not very deep. Actually, it's way shallower than I was closer to shore. We get better about to turn it up. It's probably only about five feet under the ice. Fit the bale. Underneath the trigger. Turn the alarm on. And away we go. We'll leave that for a half an hour and uh, we'll move again. The highlight of the day today on the buddy heater and a cooking grate is Poirier's Pizza Deluxe. No green peppers. Doesn't get any better than that. I'm watching Clayton here, I think I got a fish on. Missed him. Watching Clayton and missed him. Got him. He hit her. Oh, just a little sour, but there's one for Clayton. 
Not a 30 inch trout, but. <laughs> Just hooked in the corner of the mouth, that's good. This isn't, oh, watch those hooks. Those hooks like to hook my hands six times this year. No, not very big a hammering handle. Here he goes. Okay, back to Clayton catching them trout. Tough one. A little mid-day update. Lunch was good. Smokies. Fishing's been okay. Who's that? It's a pretty big fish. I'm gonna try to try to ching him up here. I'll pull this one out. I'll put him in the bucket. See if I end it. I should just have two rods in here. That's what I should be doing. Put the scissor kick down. You come up and you look at it, but they don't. Uh... He's looking at it, but. There he is. Perch. A perchy worchy. That's what it was. Oh, and he's off. They're getting bigger. Too bad you have the little yellow grubs in them there. This one doesn't look too bad. Anyway, let you go. Send your big brother. Well, that's going to do it. Caught a few fish, but not too much. Caught one pike for Chris and Sandy for Good Friday. That was one of the objectives. Caught a few perch. Had a beautiful lunch of Poirier's pizza on the buddy heater. Watch Clayton's latest video. It doesn't get too much better than that. Hopefully we can get out one more time with all this crazy weather we're getting. Thanks for watching as always. Hopefully see you on the hard water. Punching out. Soft at the spot. Not a problem. <laughs>